I'm Paul Magnard. Uh, I've been working at Alison Bob for more than a year and a half as a quantum engineer. And I work more specifically on designing and producing new hardware solutions for our research. Today, we received two new crafts at Obelix and Idefix, and we are installing them in our laboratory. These cryostats are beautiful and complex objects. It's a bit like a boat. You would not sail a boat which you don't give a name to. A cryostat is essentially a big fridge that can go to extremely cold temperatures, ten thousandths of a degree above absolute zero. We need the cryostats because we need our quantum processes to be as cold as possible. First, they need to be superconducting, so we need to be below the critical temperature. And second, temperature means noise, incoherent behavior of the electromagnetic field that could deter the quality of the quantum information in our processor. For it to be cold, you need to be able to circulate your cryogenic fluid. And so there is a room dedicated to the pumps and the compressors to cool down the cryostat. We received these machines from Blue Force, a company based in Finland. To install these two fridges, we are a team of five people composed of mechanical engineers, quantum engineers and technicians. Blue Force also send an engineer that comes and helps the installation. We first unpack the cryostat and all the elements to mount the whole system. Then we assemble the mounting structure. We place the cryostat in it. Then we connect the pipes and pumps so that we can circulate the cryogenic fluids all the equipment is very expensive and very fragile. If you tilt it by more than a few degrees or if you bend the flexible pipe a bit too much, you might cause permanent damage to it. Finally, we connect the instruments all together. The end of the installation consists in trying a first cool down to certify that it works at our place. Blue Force is one of the leaders in selling dilution refrigerators, the type of cryogenic system we use. And what we like with them is that the system are really reliable. And when we have an issue, they react very quickly and fix our problems. We want to accelerate our research to try more chips, try more processes. For that, we just need more cryogenic space. By hosting these two new and bigger cryogenic systems, we're tripling our research capacity. We can put more chips and bigger ones. Essentially, these two new fridges will enable us to scale up uh, our chips, to make bigger chips and go towards full-scale quantum processes.